Uh, next is some Ryan Damone. And subject is, has Conan ever interacted with AEW's Mega Parek? According to the Cornette Brian last narrative, CM Punk did nothing wrong. And the reason why the investigation is biased is because AEW chief legal officer Mega Parek is friends with the Young Bucks and has Jericho in her ear and refused to interview A Steel's wife. Have you ever met her? Does she hang out after the shows? Do you think she's a dishonest person who's lying about what she saw and is willing to risk her NFL Jaguars career being the senior vice president and chief legal officer because she's just great friends with the Young Bucks and Jericho? That's from Ryan. Do you know this girl, Conan? Yeah, I know her. Um, yeah, she worked. She she was there like in, when I had meetings with Tony and Dorian from AAA. Right. She was there like as a legal counsel or something like that. Did she ever have to say anything? Or I found anything her. The meeting? Well, I spoke to her like off. You know, like when the meeting was over, like we just chopped it up. I found her to be very professional in what she was doing. And I mm-hmm. don't think she'd she'd do anything like that. But, you know, I don't know, you know, exactly what they're re- what they're referring to. But yeah. I found her to be very, very professional in a corporate setting. Yeah. Interesting. Um, why did this event? Let me ask you a question, too. Why is this investigation? Why did it take so long? I mean, well, you have still, a, you had the legal counsel. Still long going, witness- right? Yeah, but what? What? How? How is that possible? You literally have I, the eyewitnesses. I mean, you, you get their stories and you figure out what. what they just got to. They want to make sure they probably punish the right person, and they're trying to figure out what fallout they're going to have, depending on who stays. If somebody's going to sue them or not, you know. I mean, there's there's legal issues involved too. I think Meltzer. Well, Dave was a kind of, uh, yeah, Meltzer's kind of a little getting a little upset about the fact that they're keeping everything. So quiet about this. Remember, we right. talked about that in the. Well, everybody is. Yeah. yeah, everybody is. But he, he yeah, did he did know. report that the uh, investigation concluded, which is how Ace Steel went up released and the elites coming back to TV. So okay, was, so yeah. what are the what what are the what's uh she she did the, the, what the, is the, a what is a report on your conclusion? You know what is the no 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 yeah. the, the the question that the the email's premise was is that Brian Lass and Cornet because they're, they're they're they like Trump or excuse me Punk. Uh, mm-hmm. That they think that the, the her version of the, whatever is a sham because it, she's friends with the young bucks. I, I like I said, I, I, uh, I doubt. Yeah, but I'm sure she's right. not the only person that was that was questioned. Right. There were other people involved, and in, you know, if you right. you know what I'm saying. So, um, uh, I just wonder. Yeah, if if this has already been concluded, where's the report? What's yeah. the final? Right. Who got suspended for how long? Who's going to work there? Who isn't? What's going on? Why aren't people being informed? Yeah. It yeah, ain't like it. we can't pretend it didn't happen. We can't pretend it's going to go away and we can't pretend it's going to fix itself. So as a responsible company, you need to come out and tell us, okay, this guy suspended two more weeks. This guy is coming back this week. This guy will never work with us. You just can't leave people hanging. Right. Especially a loyal, a loyal fan base like this. Right. They've been for the for the fan. Their fan base been very, very loyal. You know what I'm saying? This is kind of like so they're saying I think like that was know, a huge right. mistake. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Uh, next is from Anthony Hunt, and I, you know what? Honestly, they only get like around nine hundred thousand. You know, like I wonder if a, like that many people may have left, like quit watching. Like if there's a considerable amount of people because they haven't informed them, they kind of like a good. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I'm sp- speculating. That's all I ever do anyway. Yo, what up? This is Conan, and I host Keeping It 100, my co-host, Disco Inferno, unfortunately. Well, I'd say you're my co-host. Listen, every Thursday here on Spreaker, we talk pro wrestling, sports, movies, music, TV, pop culture, and some politics. It's everything the rest of the pro wrestling podcasts are not. Tune in to hear myself, the superior one, educate and inform. Tune in to hear me bury Disco. That's very disrespectful. Join us every Thursday on Spreaker and Keep It 100. Boom!